。Aloha。こんにちは。Hello。Welcome。ようこそ。And in true 2021 fashion, we wanted to share with you some lessons and key takeaways from this year's virtual Emerging Leaders program. After being a part of the US Japan Council and ELP program, I became more curious about my identity than simply being ethnically Japanese. Ten years ago, I participated in the Cherry Blossom Festival, and it changed the way that I viewed my Japanese culture. It's been an amazing experience because I've been able to meet and network with people my age who are just as passionate about their heritage and culture and helping the community. The Greater US Japan Council have provided me with a feeling of a community that I didn't know was missing in my life. My birth father is Japanese from Japan, and while I don't know him and it's never bothered me, through our various sessions and speaking with other ELPs, I realized that finding out more about him can help me explore my Japanese culture and heritage that I can then share with my daughter. It has been such an amazing opportunity to get to learn from business leaders in the United States, Japan, and even here in Hawaii. Throughout the program, I've been touched and consistently impressed at how everyone is so gracious of their time and sharing their experience and knowledge. It's just been eye opening to see. The kinds of things that they've been able to do, not only for Japanese Americans, but also just、uh, on an international level. One of the sessions that I won't ever forget was from Roy Ann Doi, who spoke to us about mentorship and sponsorship and the importance that it can have. We learned about cross cultural collaboration and how important it is to make your breakthrough with unique skill sets and expertise so you can challenge the norm and uncover opportunities. We don't just learn about leadership in general. But also how our Japan America backgrounds can add value and bring different views to the table. For me, I'm always trying to figure out how to break through with the Japanese market. And with all the Silicon Valley technology and innovation that's slowly making its way over the Pacific, you know, maybe this is the right time to leverage that expertise and earn that spot at the table. I hope that we can continue to foster incredible relations. Both with the US, Japan, and also more broadly, just with the US Pacific region. I look forward to continuing to work with these people for years to come and really help make a difference and you know, inspire other future leaders like myself years from now. It's been a crazy year and a half, but I know we're starting to see the light at the end of the tunnel. So looking forward to being with you all in person again soon. Thank you, USJC, for providing me the tools and opportunities to become a better leader. Thank you so much to the US Japan Council and sponsors for putting together such an amazing program. Aloha! Aloha! Aloha.